Hello my friends, thanks for stopping by. I hope you're all having a great day. First I want to say thank you to all of you for the amazing, fabulous, beautiful comments that you all left on my Nordstrom try-on haul. Y'all know how to make this almost 58-year-old feel really good. So I thank you all. It encourages me and motivates me to bring you more try-on haul videos. So I thank you so much. You made my you just made my whole day. I thought this is really great. Anyway, it is that time of month. We are going to go through my trash and then I have a little bit of chit chat for you and um, then I'll let you be on your way. So let's get started. First item I'm going to show you is no surprise here. I love Nubian Heritage products and I love the Raw Shea Butter Body Wash. It's their age defying protection. I love the smell of this. It's very creamy has just enough lather and it does work at hydrating my skin. I still have to moisturize afterwards but it does hydrate the skin. So I really love those and these have no harsh chemicals, they're vegan, cruelty free. More and more I think companies are coming out with quality products that are cruelty free and vegan which I know appeals to so many especially the cruelty free uh, and it does me too. So Nubian Heritage is one of those companies. Uh, finished up my last shave cream of the kiss my face i had uh, i used to use this all the time and i had a couple of backups so i just finished it up i can't buy this in my area anymore if i wanted it i could order online this is very nice uh, it leaves the legs feeling very moisturized and it cuts down on nicks for me it really does all right so staying along the natural line we are going to talk about alba botanica this is their hawaiian body polish I love this. This is great for the woman who wants to exfoliate but doesn't really have time to moisturize and lube up after her shower because you're really, you have this much time to get ready. This is going to be a good product for you because it's a sugar scrub and it has moisturizing, moisturizers built into it so you're exfoliating but it leaves behind a really nice moisture barrier but not greasy. I really like this a lot. Of course you see it in almost every empty. I'm just throwing the things on the floor here. I'll pick them up after. Alright so um, next product I'm going to talk about. I love this love this product and it is by Caudalie and it is their nourishing body lotion. I love the way my skin feels with this. I feel very, when I'm using this product, this might sound really strange, I feel very feminine and I feel like I'm putting something very luxurious on my body. I don't know why but I do and it smells nice. It's a very nice moisturizer. It, it gets the job done without leaving you feel super greasy. Next product is by Elgenis, a line that impresses me. It, this is their Genius Melting Cleanser. So this would be comparable to a cleansing balm. I really like this one a lot. Um, this tube lasted me a very long time. <clears throat> Excuse me. I put a little bit in my hands and I either remove my makeup with it if I feel like it that night or I just use it on... Um, skin that I've already removed my makeup. Sometimes this is my morning cleanser. Leaves my skin feeling very nourished. But what I really like about this one is it's one of those cleansing, melting cleansers, cleansing balm type that you put on but when you put a little bit of water with your hands it then gives you that foaming action because you know I'm a suds me up girl but those suds aren't good for us you know. So I do like this product would buy it again. I would buy any of the products that I've already mentioned again. I, I really like to let you know if I would buy it again and I would. Uh, another product that yes I would buy again and I do like this line. This one is along the lines of the cruelty free and this is the Indie Lee and this was the CoQ10 toner. This left my skin feeling really fresh and clean. After I would cleanse I would put this toner on and I just pour it in my hands, pat it and pat it into my my skin. Sometimes when you use a cotton swab you're leaving a little bit of product behind so I just drizzle a little in my hands, go like this and then pat it into my skin. I really like this. I will get it again. I also love their rose hip cleanser. That was very good. I kept it in the shower but be careful because these are glass bottles. Um, this one lasted me I'd say quite a bit. What I'm doing my friends is I have cut myself down 
uh, as to make better videos for you, give you better reviews on products. I am not using all kinds of different products. I said, okay, this is the only toner I'm using this month. So now I'm focusing on using the Eminence line, which will take me a couple of months to get through, but, and then uh, that's not to say that I won't add a couple of goodies in there, but I am focusing on using up one product so that you can know whether I really liked it or not. And remember, we are all different. What I like, you may not. Okay, next product is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day uh, Nightcap Overnight Perfector. You've heard me talk about this in the past. I finished this up. I'm not going to be buying this again for a particular reason, but I will say that I have enjoyed using this product in the probably year and a half that I have used it. And the way I used it was as a night mask on the ends down of my hair and um, I really really do like this product and had I not stumbled into something else I would probably buy it again but I have other things to talk about okay uh, also finished up two Revita Lash mascaras I love Re Revita Lash their mascara is very good I love their volumizer uh, their primer it is a cobalt blue, but once you put your mascara over, I think having that blue, it just makes the color of the black more vivid or the brown, whichever uh, color you're using. Love, love, love this mascara. We'll always have a tube on hand. I will. Okay. All right. So finished up a, the healthy deodorant. I do not wear antiperspirants. I only wear deodorants for the reason most of you would think, uh, because of the chemicals and the, uh, breast cancer and Alzheimer's. Uh, I don't like using that. Now I am a person who does sweat. I'm not a dainty girl that is always dry, but for me, the, the steel it works okay. And if I have something that we are going to, and I know it's going to be warm and I don't want my, I don't want to be pitting out in my outfit, which I don't really pit out, but I will use an antiperspirant for that day. But for the most part, I use the healthy deodorants. I have other brands that I've tried and uh, I like this. Now I have seen people give reviews on this that just did not like it. If you're a person that wants to stay bone dry, this is not for you. But if you're a person looking for a good healthy alternative in a deodorant, I don't stink with this. That's what's important to me. I don't stink. So I do like those. Um, products. And I also started using the Dr. Dennis Gross. I use the, the pads all the time, but I bumped it up to the Alpha Beta Extra Strength Daily Peel. Uh, I see no reason uh, as a dry skin person, as long as you are not ultra sensitive, why you could not use this. They have not dried my skin out. I think the clarity of my skin is looking uh, really good. And I do like that it really addresses the flakiness that's left behind from the Retina A, which my dermatologist just bumped me up to the next one because I was using 0.25 and she said, it's going to do nothing for you. So she bumped me up. So I started using that and I get most of my flaking around here and around this area here, which I don't mind because I'm hoping it flakes those jowl marionette lines right off my face. But anyway, uh, I will buy these again and I do like them and they are the extra strength, my friends. But then again, remember I address my dryness. I use those, but then all of my products are for addressing my dry skin. So you'll have to make sure that you are using a really good solid uh, serum and moisturizers to follow up with that. Okay. You can't just wipe your face with that and be off because you'll be maybe a prune, maybe. All right. So in the shower, I also finished up the Aven. This is their gentle purifying scrub. I think this is a wonderful scrub for people who want to manually exfoliate your skin because it is a very gentle exfoliation. And, um, it was very good for my dry skin. It didn't dry me out at all. I love the event line. Uh, their thermal water makes their products special. So uh, I would recommend this. I also finished up, I think Lisa sent me these, uh, Swispers. I like them. Um, they, these are so almost identical, but there's just that 
pinch of them that's a little bit different for me but uh, I would buy these I absolutely would buy these you don't need to go spend I think it's nine dollars for the Shiseido bag I don't know how much these are because like I said I think Lisa sent these to me uh, I also finished up this scrub that I was using and this is okay I wouldn't buy it it's very very messy so if you're someone that cannot handle a mess in your shower this is not going to work and I am not my shower is glass enclosed so when stuff sprays on the glass I can just spray it off if you have a shower curtain that you just adore you're not going to want to use this because it's messy and it's I won't buy this one again but it did work nice and it did leave my skin with a little moisture barrier but um, this was expensive for the amount and again all natural cruelty free vegan friendly made in Australia from my mates down in Australia. All right, so that is it for my empties, but I did want to have a little chit chat about something else because I do have some empties that uh, are with this line. And I have to say that in my Nordstrom video, uh, the, the try on haul video, so many of you, so, almost every single person had something to say about my hair. And I thank you very much. And a few of you who are very in tune to my head of hair said, okay, what are you doing? Something is different. Now I did uh, add some highlights, a little bit of lightness around because my whites are getting so bad that it's better for me to go a little bit lighter. But that would have nothing to do with the health of my hair. That's just the color of my hair. So I'm going to so, share these empties with you. And uh, many of you are starting to hear about this basically on YouTube. And I had never heard about these products until I saw Lisa's video. And then she sent me a couple of the sample. And I am sold hook, line, and sink, sinker. Hook, line, and sinker, yes. Uh, and I bought the whole shebang. Everything. Everything. I love it so much that I became a market partner. And I know that that is the part that truly bothers some people about this line, but it is no different than the Pampered Chef. It's no different than Stella and Dot. It's no different than Avon, than Mary Kay. It's no different from uh, Silpata. It's the same, you have to go to a rep to buy it. They do home parties. You can do home parties with this. You don't have to. I but want to introduce these products to as many people as I can that I know suffer and struggle with their hair because I don't know a woman or a man on this planet that doesn't want great hair. Now, I can't guarantee that it's going to solve every single problem out there, but I can only speak for myself and how well these products just that I think I've been using it a month and a half, maybe two months at the most. And I have only used the shampoo, the conditioner and the oil. And I will tell you right now, I'm going to insert a clip right here. Um, my makeup in my last few videos, I've been adding one drop of the Juvenique oil into my foundation, rubbing it in. You can see what I'm doing in this clip. And this and oil has so many good oils in it. This line does not have argon. It has abacene. It has three particular ingredients that are um, unique to this line. And all of the products have some of this and those ingredients in it some more than others but uh, I'm not going to go into all of that in this video if you would like me to do a dedicated video to Monate you let me know but uh, I did put this in my um, foundation and my last couple of videos that's what I've had on and it mixes well with all foundation uh, foundations uh, and I also use this on my scalp at night before I go to bed very little is needed I think people will overuse these products very very little but I put a drop on my scalp and then I massage it into my scalp and uh, I've been using it that way and I also mix it in with the blow cream blowout serum uh, just a couple of drops of it I emulsify them together in my hands and run them through my strands and just I've been happy I'm very happy with the product very happy and I wanted to show you the uh, that's the blow dry blow it's called only for you by Monate blowout cream uh, I use very little bit of it mixed in with the oil, run it through my damp strands, and then are, there I go. And I also, in my empties, is the ma mask. Now, the mask, I wash my hair daily, so I use the mask once a week, and I love it. I will be honest, I went through it quick because my hands were slippery and I dropped it. I was like, oh no, oh no, 
it was just washing down the drain, but there was like a quarter of it left. I used some of it and then some of it splashed out down the drain and I used the rust, but I love it. Love it. Love the smell of it because I'm very sensitive to smell. Nothing really irritates. And I do have some samples. Now this company's not real huge into samples. And to be honest with you, um, samples are okay with some things, but with hair products, a little sample isn't really going to help you. It's going to let you see what it smells like, if it lathers, and how your hair feels one time. But with this system and it promoting healthier hair, healthy strands, healthy scalp. How many of you have heard me talk about healthy scalp? That's why I was so attracted to the Bio Repair 8 by Colorproof. But the Colorproof, I will tell you, I used it for a while before I started using this one. And I will say that I liked the scalp but it dried my hair out terrible. My hair felt like horse hair without conditioner on it. It really did not work for the strands of my hair. Uh, I had no, I had a couple of breakout on my scalp, um, but, uh, and I think that might've been from the serum, but I'm still um, blown away by this Monate line over that line. And you know, I love the Colorproof line. I'm not here to say any of the products that I have talked to you about are bad. You know, I still believe in Colorproof. I'm not going to be using anything but the Monate line, and I haven't been for a little while now. And uh, this is uh, what I'm going to focus on right now, so that as I go through my journey with Monate, you can all decide for yourself if this is for you. I am telling you it's fabulous. But anyway. um, and today I just wanted to show you what I used on my hair today. I do have their hairspray on and I will tell you that I like it. It's very soft. It's not making my hair crunchy and it smells nice and it does add a little bit of shine. So I do have my hair finished, my hot rollers, and I don't brush or anything afterwards. You all know that I just let my hair go. And the shampoo that I use today is the Renew Shampoo, and this is the Moisture, Shine, and Strengthen Shampoo. And then for a conditioner, because I was going to use the mask, and I like to use a conditioner with a mask because I like to detangle a little bit. And because I do have bleached, uh, I do have some bleach because of the highlighting in my hair. Uh, I feel that I, that's just the way I like to do it. So I use the Revitalize Conditioner, which is infused with the Rejuvenique and uh, gives you a little bit more body. So that I focused on the top half. Remember, you can use just one. You don't have to use both. But then, of course, uh, today, because I wanted you to see the results of it, I did use the Monate um, mask and I use it once a week and that I focused on the strands of my hair and as you can see it does not weigh your hair down at all. It's beautiful. It, it, it really is. And then there is the Restore Leave-In Conditioner, which I did not use, but I was going to. And then the Rejuva Beads. And the Rejuva Beads, all you need is a small amount. Now if you're like me, <laughs> I don't get my hair cut often. I think I'm going into 18 weeks that I haven't had my hair cut and I don't get it cut every single time I go. That's why I focused and I've always focused on masking and using good products. Now I realize it might be out of the price range for some people and I, I do understand that. Anyway, it's the Rejuva beads and all you do is take a tiny bit of these, massage it into your fingertips and just run it through the strands of your ends and it's like it bonds them temporarily but it bonds them so that you're you can wear that smooth look if you like and I was thinking of doing a video and um, I guess the feedback from this video will let me know I thought I would go ahead and use all the products that I purchased including Lose Line and I'll even use the shave cream on my legs I don't care uh, for Lose Line it was a shampoo and conditioner this is a two-in-one and then there is an aftershave moisturizer and there is a shave cream there is a styling paste and there oh there's also supplements I'm going to take these the supplements and I bought I got the baby line and I may send that to Jace um, 
And uh, I just, I, I bought the whole big market partner pack so that I could try absolutely everything in this line. I think the only thing that did not come in it is the deep conditioner. So uh, that one I'll have to order and try that out. But I was thinking that I would do a video using all of the lines that I do have and maybe just, you know, show you a split screen what my hair looked like using each of them. But uh, I am super impressed. I can't even say that I like these products. I can honestly say I love absolutely everything I have used. So if I can help any of you out, I will put my link. It's my Monate. It's my website. I will put my link. You can go over, ahead, go over and take a look and I will put the email that you can email me at if you have any questions. I do not have samples to hand out. Uh, there are different levels. You can become a market partner yourself. You can become a VIP or you can simply, and if you become a VIP, you get a percentage off and, um, you get free shipping as long as you commit to like three months or something like that. And you can auto, you can auto ship, but you can schedule it your way. I'm still learning everything, but, um, these are great products. These are fabulous for the hair. That's all that matters to me. And, uh, you can also buy these products individually if you choose just to try them out. So, uh, remember, uh, my link will be below. Everything I talked about will be listed and linked for you. And for those of you who have a very strong dislike or an animosity towards, um, companies that choose to market their products this way, um, I can respect that. So please be respectful of me. All right, so that is all, that is it for me, for my chit chat today and my um, empties. Uh, everything will be listed and linked below for you. And I look forward to any, to those of you who are truly interested in the Monate, I look forward to having conversation with you and uh, helping you out if that's the road you choose to go. You do not have to buy any of these products, but I think that um, they are fabulous. All right, so thanks for stopping by. Don't forget, subscribe. We're anti-aging here. Be happy, healthy, beautiful, and most of all, my friends, lovable. I love you all. Bisous, my friend. Bisous.